The Vipers were looking for their second win on home soil yesterday when they took on the Mende Muruks, who were looking for their third win in a row. The Vipers were quick to strike an individual effort by fullback Brendan Gotuno got the Vipers on the board first. A successful conversion extended their lead to 6-0, but the Muruks came back in the 19th minute, losing control for a bit, but winger Bob Tenza recovering to cross over for the team's first try. The scores remained tied at six apiece at half-time. Five minutes into the second half and a break by Muruks fullback Dixon Pipi, paving the way for a centre try by Joe Honk. The try by Joe Honk sealing the victory for the Mendy Muruks 12 points to 6. Vipers coach Leonard Tarum said that Aceboas is likely to miss the next two weeks due to injury. Yes, uh, I think we had a he, he scored, uh, the hamstring or uh, he scored major injury so we would probably let, rest him for uh, some, some a good, a good time. Despite the loss, Tarum also sees the team improving. Uh, I think the boys played well today. Uh, uh, comparing the, the, the two last games, uh, the boys put up a good uh, show today. Uh, though we lost, but I think we, uh, I can see the uh, boys are improving. Slowly. But one thing is for sure, and that is the team needs to figure out their halves problem. Uh, I think uh, our issue today is a uh, problem today with uh, the halves, our halves and the hookers. Uh, when Asa came out, uh, the boys. Uh, control the game. I think the management is not there. 